Hi guys, it's Kaya Jean Banks, and um, today is sort of like an unplanned video. Um, I was gonna do something else, but my I forgot to charge my laptop first, so I can't have it over there to do my makeup. Um, and I've already done my makeup anyway. Um, but no, this is just a short, quick little video for anyone that's interested in uh, finding out a bit more about my shop that I'm going to be opening. Now I know I don't really have many followers on here so it's kind of yeah um, but basically sorry basically I'm going to be making a sh um, opening an online shop um, on Etsy um, I haven't decided on a name yet so don't ask me uh, but it'll be at the beginning of March that I open it and I will be selling things like this that I made um, and I'll be selling other things that in, um, that are sort of like um, related I suppose related yeah that's it um, other things that are related to either kit and play or DDLG which if you're in you will know what sort of things I'm gonna sell if you're into those um, however, I'm not going to be selling ears or tails because I don't know how to make those at the moment. Whereas, basically, I'm going to be making collars like this. Um, there will be other options available, though, um, of collars and stuff. I'll do different styles. Um, then I will also have... Um, an option of cuffs that will match or I will do singular bracelets um, in similar styles um, I also am going to offer um, chokers for people that don't necessarily want pet or that sort or, or play gear yeah. uh, pet play gear or like DDLG gear but they just want like a nice um, choker um, for instance, the one I made for my mum, she is not into this sort of stuff really in any way. Um, she just wanted a gothic looking choker. Um, so I made her one and I'll be offering stuff like that on, on my site. And then um, then it will get to things more like, um, I'm, I mean, I'm still in the process of attempting to make the first one. So yeah, but hopefully I'll also have pacifier gags on there. Um, for people that are interested um, and then like um, hopefully I'm going to learn how to make leashes slash leads whichever you want to call it depending on where you're from and things like that basically but they're all um, I will have different options they won't all be like cute and pastel coloured um, like what mine is some will be I haven't really had an experience with leather at the moment but um, some will be sort of more gothic-y looking or yeah but um, I'm not going to be making customs at the moment um, that will be something that if I get enough people asking me for customs um, rather than you know just buying the pre-mades um, then yeah but basically how it's probably going to work with the pre-mades is that um, I'm going to list one on there that I've made but if you want it in a different size just ask say oh can you do it in this size and I'll leave her see if I can fix the one that I've done which I probably won't because my stitching's awful anyway <laughs> um, but I should be getting a sewing machine so it should be fine um, but if I can't adjust it to the size that fits you or if it doesn't already fit you like if it's a little bit smaller than your neck um, where it's tied with ribbon that's fine it doesn't it's not a massive issue unless you want it to be locked on um whereas if it's like too big then um i might just make a smaller one for you in the same style or if you want something um if if i don't have it in your size and you're smaller you, and you want it slightly differently that's fine um just send a message on what you want me to change um that's fine but um yeah it'll probably work like that um and then if i get enough interest um and stuff goes really quickly then i probably will offer custom maids because it might it might work out where with my studies 
um, at university, I might not always have the money um, or time until I earn a bit from this. Um, I might not necessarily have um, the ability to always pre-make everything, so I might have to sort of like, um, well, I might have to like, yeah, just like, what do you want? Um, a person message me and then like, I'll make them what they want, but they have to pay me first. Which, so then I can afford the materials, you know, I'm not made of money, I'm a uni student. Um, but yeah, so, I think that's about it, and uh, sorry about the background, like I said, usually I would be filming over there with that wall as my background that's pretty much behind you, but um, my laptop's on charge. Because I'm an idiot. It was on like 9% and I was like, no, that's not going to last. <laughs> Damn, Max. Um, yeah, anyway, that's pretty much it. I just wanted a short, quick video. Well, I mean, this is short for me. Um, just to explain. Um, so, if you are interested, um, send us a message on what you would like to see on my site. Uh, shop. Not site. On my shop. Um, I will also, once I have decided the name and I've made a few bits and taken some photos of it, then I will make a page and I'll let you know about that. It'll be a page on Facebook, um, to which I'm also going to have a model shoot of people wearing the gear that I make. Um, and yeah, I will possibly, sorry, <laughs> fine, um, I'll possibly be looking for some uh, promoters but that will probably be in the future that might not be straight away but I'll, I'll explain it all um, once I open the shop probably um, but yeah I just wanted a quick advance I mean I know it's only the end of January now but I thought it's better to sort of put it out there now that I am opening a shop for that sort of stuff and if anyone is interested um, then yeah I probably will end up making ears and tails if I can figure it out and I'm also in the future hoping to make corsets that um, can potentially match the other items um, so you would have like for instance you would have a collar and then you'd have a corset in a similar like it would be in the same sort of colour um, scheme and maybe some of the same sort of details like the roses or a bow or spikes if that's what you wanted um, different things like that so yeah uh, just let me know what you think um, but yeah obviously things like the corsets are a little bit further down the line I hope to have um, have made at least like one or two corsets before I turn 21 um, they might necessarily just be prototypes and not go onto the shop but if people really like them, the prototypes, then yeah sure but um, they will possibly be prototypes because yeah <laughs> I'm not the most skilled but yeah um, yeah sorry this is getting long already uh, well yeah that's pretty much it um, bye guys